Ponce. It has been a long time since we came here. Uh, before Maria, it was very well kept. It had a nice long uh, boardwalk that you could walk along. Um, and Maria kind of screwed things up a little bit. But um, we wanted to kind of come see how it's doing now uh, and see if possibly there's any boats for rent and just to kind of enjoy this area. There's a lot of kiosks and fun food places. Uh, so we'll see how it's, how it's doing after, you know, five years or so. So let's see it. So right now it's kind of just a really miniature version of the former glory that the Tablado of La Huancha once had. But you can still enjoy these huge fish, you can feed them, and of course the big pelicans everywhere. So, and it's also still being used as a storage for the boats.
It's a big cost. That's right. All right, so this is a first for us. We've been up here to La Cruceta a few times, but we've never gone up to the very top. So this time we got the tickets for the whole thing, for the mansion, for the gardens, and for going up to the cross. So let's go see what it's like. from this vantage you can see pretty much all of Ponce all the way out to the Caribbean Sea. gardens which is the first time I've ever done this with the pool and all of the nicely trimmed shrubs the Cruz de Maltas, Zoras and the beautiful landscaping that they've done here. From this vantage you can see so far out into the distance. It's really beautiful.
so we have gone up to the cross. We got a little bit to eat, but we didn't have time to eat it, so we're gonna take it with us. Then we went to the tour of the castle, and now we're gonna go check out the Japanese Zen Garden. So let's go check it out. into the hotel. Uh, the elevator is broken so we get to do it old school style on the stairs. Just like they would have when it was open. We're gonna go into our room, huh Aiden? Let's show up. Let's see what, what do we got in here?
So on this trip uh, to Ponce, we stayed at Hotel Melilla. It is apparently, according to what we read, the oldest continuously run hotel in, in Puerto Rico. So it has a lot of uh, cool history, including I think that it was one of the first uh, elevators that, were, that was installed in all of the, the town. And it's currently kind of decorated with some of the old styles and themes. We enjoyed our time there. Um, they do, they're still doing remodeling and uh, so you can kind of tell it's aged over the years but it was kind of a neat time to experience what it must have been like for some people way back in the days, hundreds of years ago, at least a hundred years ago, to stay in a hotel in the historic downtown plaza of Ponce. Ooh, yeah.